depends on how these next couple fights work. Uh, how does Broke is smoking? I don't think he's ready for Chuan to hit him like that. That's fine. He, he's got to bait anyways. Oh, that observer. Oh, they see everything move. The fresh blink dagger into the Nova and a perfect storm. Miracle, no tail caught. He to saved relocate him. out. He got him in time. Miracle got sent all the way back home. No tail will still trigger. They can fight that this. That was the Aegis the Immortal. But you burnt your raw already. Fly comes in. He's got swap available. No tail. Instant cast over onto Karkar as well as Hal. And how? Well, there is no Shadow Dance. Moon wants to get back and reach the T1 tower, but now Miracle Dream Call. They have to stand. They have to fight, Newbie, but Chuan is down. The wall is up as well from KP, trying to zone OG out of this engagement. And KP, the Gus is going to hit him. The balls are on his tail, but KP will have to surge himself away. He can't actually save Moon. Not when the Cold Arrows are continuously hitting, and they actually bring down the Tidehunter. How they got him. Fight, but he's gone as well. Newbie losing everything. Oh my it's a god. Triple kill for no tail. Newbie, they tried to get out they thought maybe it was a good idea to stay and it definitely was not that was such a clutch fight crit absolutely saved everything he pulls out puck keeps puck alive where puck was almost guaranteed dead definitely gonna die without the relocate and then the Aegis on the drought, that was the other person that was left over. It bought him enough time as yep. well to, for the relocate to return. So it was a straight up 5v5 fight instead of a 3v5 until the relocate returned. And then somehow drought just killed everybody. This is so huge now, because also no tell that Dragonlance I was talking about. This is the kind of early stuff you'd love to do with Dross. It lets you go high ground against tier 3 Thick, towers oh without God. actually going high ground. The damage is ridiculous and they're going to keep it up. They in comes to. the Phoenix, but Kaka instantly gushed. Moon wants to jump in too. They've at least locked him inside inside the pen but the rolls on KP KP's going down OG they're inside the base no tells doing more work he'll end up dying Crit can't keep him alive so they've lost throw they've lost their buff up fly the dream call will trigger how however stunned up he's gonna go down drove by the his back he's almost asking for more and more but they actually wisp relocate do they want to bring him in he's relocating forward going for Chorn no who possible able to hold him they go for the racks they're gonna finish this moon inside the sun ray oh, jump from miracle Parker. he can't it off. Chuan's here, but the Nova he'll trigger just in the nick of time. Chuan, he can't survive. The top rack is gone. We're 16 minutes in. Oh Nubia are forced God. to use multiple buybacks to defend inside their base. And still, OG get out. They killed Phoenix? Dude, the creeps killed Phoenix? Yeah. That, that the, that, it was the Necros who were in there too. Oh, and he used Sunray as well, so he's lowering his own HP. Yeah. What just happened?